Yo, yeah, what's up, sneaker fam? It's your boy Will. Thanks for joining me for another video. So I'm not going to go too crazy into depth with today's video because it's only a pair of Air Force Ones. Uh, they're just a pretty sick looking pair of Air Force Ones that I recently picked up, so I thought I'd show you guys. Anyway, let's take a look at the kicks and jump into it. Here we have a pair of Air Force Ones. Uh, these aren't just stock standard Air Force Ones, of course I wouldn't just be showing you a pair of normal triple white Air Force Ones. Uh, these are kind of a special version of the Air Force Ones. They're a bit more expensive than the stock standard Air Force Ones, are uh, retailing at 210 So enough about the price tag, why don't we take a look at what's inside the box. Straight out, let's take a look at the box actually. Stock standard black, grey, smoke grey, whatever you want to call it with a nice uh, metallic silver logo on the lid. Nothing over the top, it's pretty simple because the Air Force Ones are a simple shoe. Before that, let me tell you what these exactly are. So these are the Air Force One 07s PRM uh, and the exact colorway is the smoke gray vault blue. But I'll show you why they are so different. And I really like them. These also come in white, but I prefer the smoke grey. And that is what we're bringing to the table with these Air Force Ones. Uh, they're very, very different to the stock standard Air Force Ones. Even though it's the same silhouette, there are some sick features on this pair of kicks. Um, straight out off the box, you can see. What makes these ones special is that Carabiner Nike logo. Uh, so this is attached to it. Uh, it's kind of paying homage to that rock climbing carabiner style clips that they use, uh, which is pretty cool. Um, and it's made out of that Nike tick. What's also pretty cool is that color. Uh, let me take out the other sneaker while I'm at it. Uh, just so you can get some nice detail on this sneaker. So, what we have here is that carabiner, as I mentioned before, in the Nike tick, but it is like that iridescent oil spill looking color, which I think is pretty sick. Also uh, on both shoes, unfortunately, they don't come off. I mean, you could probably wiggle your way out of getting it off, uh, but I think they look pretty sick just on the sneaker itself. It look really weird once you've got just those uh, elastic loops and everything just hanging there if you don't have that Carabiner Nike logo on it. Um, but I think it just adds something a little bit different to uh, the sneaker. It just makes the Air Force One so different. Uh, so looking at the rest of the sneaker, again you've got that oil spill looking colorway uh, lace charm on the front AF1 which matches the tick. Um, as you can see behind the carabiner on it is actually a blue tick. I'm guessing that's what that vault blue colorway there they're talking about. Yeah. Same on the other, the inside of the sneaker. So what's also pretty cool is that Nike Air emblem on the back which is in that fluoro yellow and so is the tongue it says Nike Air in that fluoro yellow tag but what's also pretty cool on this is there's actually a little pocket inside of the tongue uh, I don't know what you're planning on hiding in there uh, but they don't open and close very easily and then of course just the stock standard white midsole undersole nothing super fancy and with that smoke grey. Uh, to me it's more a blackish grey but they're gonna give it the colorway smoke grey. I'm gonna call it smoke grey. Either way it's just a clean pair of kicks. I'm gonna show you guys a closer look now uh, just so you can get the full effect of what I'm getting. They're clean but they're different and that's what I like about them. I do have the stock standard Air Force Ones um, but that can be spoken about in a later video.
we're back. So, what do you guys reckon of these Air Force Ones? Drop a comment. Let me know if you like them, you hate them, whatever. I want to hear your thoughts. So these also come in a white colorway where the whole thing is white except for the tick and that carabiner and the, the lace charm too. Uh, those all come in like a rust orange color, uh, which I personally like these a little bit more. So that's it for today's video. Thanks for joining me guys. If you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that sub button. I've got some sneaker reviews coming out in the next couple of videos. So make sure you stay tuned to see that. Or if you just want to stay up to date with my sneaker collecting, hit that sub button as well. Uh, you can also check me out on Instagram. Links are in the description. So that's it for today's video. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.